Hello everybody and welcome back to my channel. So today I thought I'd just do like a quick video giving you an update on Jesse and I trying to have another baby. Um, because I haven't updated it in a while. So, um, if you can't remember or, or you haven't seen the videos, Jesse and I have been trying for over a year and a half now to have another baby. Um, we went to the doctor when it didn't work after a few month, months and she said to try for you have to try for a year before they'll even look into anything else. So we tried for a year. And I did a video on that, so I'll link that down below. Um, but after that we went to the doctors and she started off by doing all the tests on me and then she did tests on Jessie. So I had an internal ultrasound, blood tests, urine tests, like all different kinds of tests. And they all came back with everything being perfectly fine. Um, like I have no issues or anything. So we went back to the doctor again and she checked Jesse. So the first, I think she did blood, he gets blood tests pretty often anyway because he has a care plan with the doctor because he has asthma. So he, he had a blood test um, and then he had to do a sperm count test. Yeah, I think that's what it was, a sperm count test. So um, they tested his sperm and it turns out that he's got low sperm count. So that was not good. Um, it could be due to a number of reasons. She didn't really give us a specific reason. Um, it could just be his age, his health, um, he smokes, so it could be that. Or it could, sometimes it just happens, like there's no explanation for it really. Um, so when that came back as a low sperm count, he went and had an ultrasound on his testicles to check for a blockage, because sometimes that can be the reason that there is a low sperm count. Um, and everything came back fine with that. So it's a bit frustrating. Um, and IVF has been thrown in the air a lot, so that might be a possibility if we're going to pursue that. Um, so we've currently stopped trying as of now because I'm going on a holiday to Bali in two months, I think it is. Yeah, two months. So we decided to stop trying for now, and then when I get back from Bali, we're going to try again. We're going to try again um, for about six months, I think. And if nothing happens within that six months, we're going to start saving money um, towards IVF. We I called up an IVF clinic that's five hours away from where we are. So it was about $200, I think. I think I said it in one another video. I think it was around $200 for the con just the consultation, just to go and see them and talk to them. And they only quoted me like four grand or something, like three and a half, four grand um, for one cycle of IVF. But people I've talked to and people Jesse have talked to have said there's a lot of hidden costs. So it's generally about $10,000 for one round of IVF. Um, as of now, things could change. We've, we've currently decided that it's a possibility that we'll try it and that we'll only do one round. And if it doesn't work, then that'll be it. Um, yeah, because it's just a lot of money to put into something like that. And we don't want to keep trying once I hit, like probably around the time I hit 30 is when we're going to stop trying for any more kids. So if nothing happens before then, then we're just going to stop because I don't really want to have kids after 30, just like a personal choice and whatnot. So that's what's happening as of now. I'm getting messages everywhere. Hang on. Emotionally, I have gone through stages of like um, crying and being sad, being angry that it's not happening. Um, like wondering why it's not happening and now I'm just like at a content stage where if it happens I'll be over the moon and that'd be great because I've always wanted four kids um, but if it doesn't happen I'm quite content with what I've got although I'll always probably be longing for like more kids but I guess that I like from talking to people it seems like a lot of people have that like even though they're finished having kids they always like feel like what it would be like if I had one more type thing or whatever so yeah, that's that's currently the situation. I will keep you updated on if things happen and if they don't, like what the goal is with everything. But as for now, I don't really have much else to update on besides we've just stopped. We've stopped for now and we'll be trying again soon. So anyway, I'm going to end this video. I just thought I'd give an update because I've had a lot of people asking me what the goal is with it. Thank you for watching and I'll see you for my next video, guys. Bye.